All right, guys, this is a follow-up to my 4x4 issue. I added a ground wire to the thicker part of the wire that goes to the four-wheel drive magnetic coils down to the ground. Now when I put it in gear, light lights up. Paris then. So like I said, electronic issue. And I wanted to point this out too. I've had this issue in the past. There is also your transmission shift switches down here. And if your shifter is not lined up right if it's shifting hard into gear i mean like this one isn't perfect so this is high it's low it's just a little stiff but say this wasn't in line say it was uh, not adjusted correctly or maybe you can adjust it correctly some of them are so worn out that uh it just has to be that way um, there is a way to bypass these this is your shift indicator, that's your low, your high. These wear out, you could, well, you can replace them too. But I have a video on how to bypass this. And I'm not really gonna go through it, but basically uh, you take the wiring coming down from the four x four switch and run it hot. So if you guys are more interested in uh, learning how to do that, Check out my bypass video and we'll learn more. But here you guys go. Follow up to my video. Got this bad boy running, driving, brakes work, four wheel drive works, starts. And I've gone through a lot with this thing. You know, I thought this would be a quick flip. Figured uh, just put a starter solenoid in, clean the carb and replace the rear axle shaft because that's rusted. So, you guys ever wonder what a clicking noise is while you're driving? It goes click, 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 click. Check this out. Boots are torn. That's all worn out. That just clicks when I drive. Also, your wheel bearings that are back here, those need to get greased. Very important on Polaris's. All right, hope you like my follow-up. Stay tuned for my next video, whatever it may be.